here the following balances were extracted from the books of modern traders on 31st march 2016 and in the next page it is written that prepare final accounts for the year ended 31st march 2016 after taking into account the following adjustments hence with the final accounts include trading account profit and loss account and balance sheet hence trade uh, after drawing the format of trading account we have to start with the credit side of trading account that is by sales rupees 1 lakh 20000 rupees by closing stock rupees 15000 to opening stock in the debit side rupees 15000 and after opening stock of 15000 the next one will be purchases rupees 82000 uh, to wages rupees 1300 and add outstanding wages as per adjustment number b outstanding wages rupees 500 to wages add outstanding wages 500 the total will be 1800 rupees and freight inward that is rupees 2000 the credit side is higher and it is rupees 1 lakh 35000 right in the debit side and find out the difference to gross profit carried down that is rupees 34200 the next is our profit and loss account and write down in the credit side of profit and loss account that is by gross profit brought down rupees 34200 and the next one will be by discount received rupees 400 by revenue rent revenue revenue means money coming in we are getting an income rent revenue is rupees 1200 this word revenue discount revenue rent revenue this is that this means that this is an income hence by rent revenue rupees 1200 then to carriage outwards rupees 500 in the debit side of the profit and loss account then to rent rates and taxes rupees 4600 to printing and stationery rupees 800 to postage and telegrams rupees 800 to vat debts rupees 400 and add new provision rupees 1030 and you have to deduct less old provision rupees 800 here the vat debt provision is estimated to be 5% on debtors hence here we have the debtors and we have to find out on debtors 5% as provision for vat debt on 20600 rupees that is rupees 1030 and old provision provision for doubtful debts given in the trial balance is old provision balance of accounts no trial balance is there there is one extract only and vat debt is given in the extracts rupees 4 400 in the adjustment we have only new provision and after adding the first one deducting old provision we are getting in the final column rupees 630 the next is our to insurance rupees 700 and less prepaid insurance that is adjustment number d prepaid insurance rupees 100 after deducting rupees 100 we will be getting rupees 600 in the final column next one is to salaries rupees 20000 in the debit side to depreciation on we have to charge depreciation provide depreciation the last adjustment e part depreciation on plant and machinery at 10% and furniture at rupees 5% hence to depreciation on plant and machinery on rupees 40000 that is 4000 and furniture rupees 250 and 5000 at the rate of 5% the total depreciation will be 4250 and we have to add we have to add the credit side first because the balance is higher than the debit side the totaling is rupees 35800 write it in the debit side and find out the difference to net profit carried down that is rupees 3620 and in the balance sheet as at 31st march 2016 we have in the asset side current assets that is cash in hand rupees 6200 cash at bank rupees 25500 prepaid insurance rupees 100 closing stock rupees 15000 debtors rupees 20600 less 
new provision for bad debts that is rupees 1030 in the final column we will have rupees 19570 and in the fixed assets we have this furniture rupees 5000 less depreciation rupees 250 and in the final column we will have rupees 4750 then plant and machinery rupees 40000 less accumulated depreciation that is rupees 9000 till today because de- accumulated this is very important point plant and machinery depreciation for the current year is 10% and we have given accumulated depreciation in the trial, trial balance and that is rupees 9000 you can see the accumulated depreciation that is the fourth item from the beginning accumulated depreciation 9000 we can take it on this uh, uh, furniture as well as on this machinery but uh, though machinery is having a higher value we can deduct it from there this accumulated depreciation can be shown in the liability side or be deducted from the plant and machinery and again after that we can deduct depreciation for the current year rupees 4000 and total depreciation in this case for plant and machinery is 11000 and this could have been shown as 11000 in the liability side but this is a better treatment you can not so you can now show it in the final column that is rupees 27000 and the totaling of the asset side is rupees 98120 rupees and in the liability side we have current liabilities that is sundry creditors rupees 9000 outstanding wages rupees 500 long term liabilities and capital on the will have a reserve fund rupees 5000 then capital rupees 85000 in the liability side less drawings rupees 5000 out of that here reserve fund is a is the amount kept aside out of the profits over a period of time is called reserve fund rupees 5000 capital is rupees 85000 less drawings 5000 then add net profit that is rupees 3620 in the final column we will have rupees 83620 and the totaling in the liability side will be rupees 98120 and this is the final answer